Would I adopt a monkey? Oh, there was a horrible story the other day about people who shave monkeys and sell them as prostitutes. Um, yeah, in Nepal. I'm not saying that all the Nepalese are doing it, but there are a few Isn't out that there. What, I wondered why your tour goes yep. like Basingstoke, Winchester, yep. Nepali Theatre, yeah. through. <laughs> Nepali. Thought, That's an odd book, isn't that, isn't it? In a Nepali Arts Centre. What's he doing that for? Yeah. Now I know. Uh, good evening, Nepal. <laughs> this is Jojo, and let me tell you. <laughs> horrible, though. Yeah. I, so I thought I was watching that and I had a look at a shaved monkey. I thought I'd quite like to adopt that. You should have put some trousers on. Well, that's what you're tempted to do. You can't help, but you can't do that. You can't dress them up in trousers. No. But then it brings a whole new meaning to PG tips, doesn't it? But they hire them out for like, you know, an hour at a time. People go off into the woods with them. But why are you shaving it? Surely if you want it, if you want to have sex with a monkey, you want the real deal. You know, if you're shaving it, then you might as well have sex with a lady. <laughs> yeah, but you don't get the back chat off a monkey, do you? <laughs> that's the thing! <laughs> Apple crumble. <laughs> and they'll make you a cup of tea. That's a fair point. I shall have a lady grey. Well, they will. They'll play the piano for you. Yeah, and t carry it upstairs as well. They will indeed. That's not an easy job. Do you Absolutely. know what I mean? Del Boy Trotter couldn't do it. Um, so you would adopt a monkey. Yeah, adopt a would monkey. Would you adapt a monkey? Ooh, would he adapt me, I think is a better question. Mm, mm. Give it a week and I'll probably be in a tyre flinging my own feculars around. <laughs> um, and know. if you had a monkey, it how much does it cost? Well, a gherkin costs twenty-five grand a year. Yeah, how much would it? Could, are you allowed pet monkeys these days? I don't think so. Not according to the sitcom Friends, which I use as my barometer for all guidance issues. Pivot. <laughs> but when uh, we should find out if anyone knows what I'm the... pretty sure you're not allowed a monkey, Russell. Otherwise, right. more people would have monkeys, wouldn't they? Well, maybe they're just pricey, John. Right. Text us, 64046 or email russell.6music at bbc.co.uk. In fact, anyone who owns a monkey, how much it would cost to get a monkey, whether we can get a show monkey, that'd be quite good. Yeah? yeah. You know, like... A six you, music chimp? No, not six music, just ours. No one else is having him. All right, you don't want merchant food. No, we don't. We, yeah, exactly. What if he prefers hanging out with merch more than us? That'd be horrible. Um, well, merch could show him some stuff, though, can he? Yeah, but he could, like, yeah, but that's... Imagine that, if... if uh, but he doesn't know you're tight with JC. But, but if, uh, and David Hasselhoff. Yeah, but, you know, I imagine he's tight with everybody. We could really show him the time. There's every chance Stephen Merchant could pay to have a monkey drive around in a Lamborghini. We can't do that. No, but we've got, like, we could We could, we just could show him a good him time. We could, we could hang out with him. We could show him a good time, but we could never show him the, the, the monetary side of the Merchant's thing. got money, but I bet his social skills have suffered as a result. Whereas we're still trying. So we could just <laughs> sort of sweet talk the monkey into driving the Lamborghini. You go down the Lamborghini. We could sweet talk. You could get a Lamborg. You're doing all right. No, but we could we could sweet talk the the monkey into nicking a Lamborghini. Yeah. Just, yeah. Imagine that. Just you go here, yeah, right, Stevie, Stevie. Punch that one in the face, right? Nick the keys. We'll meet you around the back. Oh ah! Right, go, 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 go. John's got a really cool project on the go. Tell everyone. They might know about it. Telling them so they can steal it. I know about this fella. Stuff. The no, fella no, that you're no, like, no. Oh, actually. No, no, no. Hey, I've got a book for you called The Fatal Englishman. It's about people. Uh, who never fulfil their potential and die young. Which kind of- Cheers, mate! No, 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 Thanks! But, but what that, a cracking birthday I'm having! No, but that ties in here's with- Here's a mate you've fallen out of touch with. Well, it's me doing an impression of him, and here's a book about dying young. It ties in with that Lorca thing, wasn't that- Top yourself. Go on. I didn't say that, John! I buy a monkey with a gun, yeah, and get him to shoot you with cream eggs until you die in the face. What's the latest on monkey front? Well, we've had an incredible text in that I can only assume was written by a five-year-old. Right. Uh, <laughs> I met a girl in Lima that slept with a monkey in her hair. It was only small, and it died one night. Say that again, right? Well, back That's up. That's the whole text. No, but slow it down. I met a girl in yep. Lima. In Lima, yep. Yeah, that slept with a monkey in her hair. Right. It was only small. Yep. And it died one night. Oh, okay. Rob. There was a bloke who uh, smuggled a monkey on a plane. <laughs> Someone <laughs> uh, got these goddamn monkeys out for this goddamn plane. Well, what I thought, I thought you, mi I thought you misinterpreted week. smuggled for snuggled. <laughs> you know, I thought that's why you were giggling. That had calmed down people who were scared of flying, wouldn't it? What? Give them a little monkey to cuddle. I'll be dreadful. Well, that's an interesting thing. Pretty bumpy flight on the way back from Glasgow. But, it's the first time I've ever thought, oh, we're, we're a long way up. But you're in flight monkey, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's an interesting point, actually. But would it calm you down or would they. Because you'd probably get a really irritated one that kept slapping you. Would passengers please press the chimp button yeah. if they want a chimp? And it just lowers down. In the event of an emergency, yeah. a monkey will drop down. Pull the chimp towards your face yeah. <laughs> to inflate. <laughs> Always put your chimp on before helping others <laughs> with their chimps. <laughs> they don't half talk in an irritating way, stewardesses, don't they? They have this. It bothers me when.